I got off a Facebook Messenger call that came out of the blue and I was focused on my clients and various business things, so I answered the call and it was a person, a woman from the in Indonesia or the Philippines, looking for a husband. <laughs> and I explained to her politely that I'm not her guy, I'm happily married and I'm living here in Denmark, and I was polite to her and I got off the phone relatively quickly. However, it got me thinking, that woman? Maybe she could be a really good business person. Why? Because it takes a lot of guts to call out of the blue and say, I'm having a hard time here where I am and I'm looking for a husband. That's tough. And you're going to get a lot of uh, rejection. You are. And you're going to be judged for it. And if you want to be an ent entrepreneur, if you want to be a business person, if you want to market yourself online, if you want to be a professional artist who is hawking his or her wares and trying to get people to buy your stuff, you have to have the same kind of metal. You have to have the same kind of inner strength. You got to get tough. You got to toughen yourself up. You have to feel that you know exactly what you're saying and why. You have to believe in what you're doing and why it helps people so that you can just keep moving forward and moving forward. This isn't for the meek. This isn't like easy peasy just because someone gives you a system. You're gonna get this gradual increase and sometimes it feels like two steps forward, one step back. And sometimes it feels like one step forward and two steps back. If you're running your own ship, if you're at the helm, you are the go-to person and the problems become yours at every level of the game. When someone else screws up, if you don't know their language and you're trusting them to do something and they fuck it up, they fuck up your stuff and all they can do is apologize. But for you, you gotta get tough. It reminds me of my friend Kenny Carter. He was a glass blower and uh, at his glass blowing studio, apparently, this is something that's in many glass blower studios, um, they have a sign there because, as we all know, molten glass is really, really hot. 1800 degrees, 2000 degrees, it's hot. And therefore, you are dealing, getting very close with that long punt, digging in and gathering some glass, and it will you put your you pour hot you pour cold water on your arm all the way up to your shoulder and then you gather a bunch of molten glass at the end of your pipe and you pull it out and by the time you've done that all of the water is evaporated off your arm and most of the hair is gone too so the sign says if you're going to be dumb you gotta be tough. <laughs> and that is one of the credos that helps you move forward. Whether it's two steps forward, no steps back, two steps forward, one step back, one step forward, two steps back, or no steps forward, two steps back. You're gonna have all of those. You're gonna have them all. Get tough. If you don't have what it takes, <sighs> I don't even know how to answer that. I don't know how to finish that sentence. <laughs>